from start to finish. Very well there, like I step up. But Laval, Carlos uh, were great. But Nazi gave us good minutes. Jimmy, uh, you know, Kirk just kept us organized. Great job. Great job. You got on the one end, on the one end, LeBron scores 32 points, and there in it looked like you kind of put him in a role of a scorer and played physical against him as well as a facilitator. Is that your approach? Well, you, the thing uh, about LeBron is, uh, you know, and, and Wade keeps a lot of pressure on him also. Those two guys are two guys that can break your, your defense down off the dribble at any time. And they're both very, very unselfish. And LeBron has great decision-making ability and great vision. His size, he sees over things. I don't think he can give him a steady diet of anything. Uh, I thought covering the three-point line, and you know, at, at times we, we covered it okay, but uh, they've been making a lot of threes. And so you have to decide what you're willing to live with. I thought the rebounding component was big for us. Uh, you know, we got a little loose with the ball to start the third quarter, uh, so that was a, a big concern. But I thought the ball movement overall was very good. Shared the ball, kept it moving. Uh, if you hold on to the ball and you dance with it against this team, they're they're so tough defensively. You know, they they they've got great hands. They you have to be aware at all times because of their activity with their hands. Uh, so if you let your guard down and you're loose, they're, they're going to strip you. So um, you know, I thought once we got straightened out with that, that uh, you know we, we took some shots in the fourth quarter. We had uh, a lot of resiliency, kept battling, uh, and uh, pulled it out in the end. Tom, can you talk about that play Kirk made where he ripped the ball from Bosch and then gets up, recollects himself, and ends up making the pass to Taj? Yeah, no, like, you know, usually, uh, for the most part, I think, you know, we've played them 15 times, a lot, and more often than not, it comes down to that, exactly that. It's a loose ball, it's a hustle play, it's, you know, it's, it's, that, that's usually the difference, and you know, and they you know, they put a lot of pressure on you. So, and, you know, we're small. Uh, you know, we needed everyone in there uh, scrapping for rebounds. Uh, I thought we did that. I know you guys, you want these guys to play at this level for every game, no matter who it is. But do you think this chat, knowing that you were coming in here with the streak, kind of hyped some of your guys up a little bit, just as inspiration? I think it, uh, it hyped up the media. <laughs> you know, uh, yeah, and, you know the thing. Obviously, they're they're a great team. So, uh, but the challenge is not to get caught up in the big one. You know, to understand what goes into winning, stay focused. You, you got to be prepared. You need to have an edge. Uh, if you get lost in all the other stuff, then you're not going to be prepared to play well. So it's a, it's important to uh, lock into getting ready to play. Uh, and then to the challenge is never to feel too good about yourself if you do win, to come back, come back, be ready to do it all over again, and get ready for the next one. The challenge for us right now is we want to be playing our best going down the stretch, and we got to continue to improve. And we got to have an edge, and we got to get healthy. Was, was playing LeBron physically part of the game plan? Kind of, like you lost quite a few hard fouls on it. No, you know, like I, I think you got to play. You know, the, the way they play. You have to play like with great intensity because they play with great. They you can't win a world championship without playing like that, you know. And I think they understand that. You know, I think that's why when when you look at what they've done to be the defending world champions and to have a, a winning streak like that, knowing that everyone's chasing, it's a credit to them. It's credit to them. So um, I think you can learn from them. Uh, they bring it every night. And, uh, you know, and we got to do 